There's no doubt that checkpoint inhibitors are changing the uh, natural history of many types of cancer we treat. And like other drugs, they're now coming to liver cancer as an afterthought. There's approvals in many malignancies, and we actually now have approvals in liver cancer. But as we sit here today, their approvals are based on single arm phase two studies and accelerated approval for both pembrolizumab and nivolumab. And this is in the second line setting. We're waiting for validation of the role of checkpoint inhibitors in liver cancer. There's the frontline study, the Checkmate 459 study, which is nivolumab versus serafinib. That study is completed accrual and we're waiting for events and a final readout. Similarly, with pembrolizumab, we're waiting for the definitive phase three study of pembrolizumab versus placebo in the second line setting. This is a, a large phase three setting study that will again definitively establish the role of this drug in liver cancer. However, given the excitement about what we've seen in the single arm phase two studies of response rates of about 15, 16% with both these drugs and very long duration of response, and what we've seen in other tumor types where there's the combination of immunotherapy agents with either VEGF receptor kinase inhibitors or even with the monoclonal antibody bevacizumab, these combinations are already moving into liver cancer. Both bevacizumab and atezolizumab in combination have completed a phase three study versus serafinib. This combination has a breakthrough therapy designation based on data presented last year that shows a response rate of about 30%. And lenvantinib in combination with pembrolizumab is now moving into a phase three study. Again, based on a small phase one, two study that shows a very significant response rate again in the 30%, 40% range. So the landscape in liver cancer is changing very rapidly and we look forward to seeing the results of phase three data, randomized data with checkpoint inhibitors, either as single agents and in the future in combinations.